Let's be honest, you probably don't need a pair of expensive tactical sunglasses. Even with the price of sunglasses going up in the last few years, making it difficult to get a pair of sunglasses at your local gas station or truck stop for under 30 bucks, you probably don't need all the premium features that come on something like these Core Essentials Recon Ballistic Sunglasses. If you don't take your sunglasses to the range, if you're not also using them as safety glasses, then having the highest impact resistance rating of sunglasses on the planet probably isn't a big thing for you. If you're not using them as safety glasses, then a thicker frame around the sides to keep things from coming in and getting to your eyes even though you're wearing glasses, and the 25% larger hinges and frame construction None of that is going to mean anything for you. If you don't work in a job where you're issued a fleet vehicle that somebody on the spec sheet decided to save $1.79 by not having a little cubby for you to put your sunglasses in, then the accessories that come with something like this, a little holder that fits in a standard cup holder where you can put your glasses in to keep them from getting destroyed, that's probably not going to help you a whole lot. If you've never destroyed several pairs of sunglasses by throwing them at the dashboard of your car in an emergency when you're trying to get out, or having them fall off the top of your head, or fall off of your shirt, or throw off a piece of equipment, or fall off of a vest carrier when you're trying to do something that you didn't anticipate having to do, then having a pair of sunglasses with magnets built into the ends of the arms that allow you to magnet mount them up onto an accessory strap on your sun visor or clip them to a shirt and have them not slide off the collar of the shirt or clip it to a vest carrier and have them not fall down as soon as you go moving in a position that you weren't anticipating moving, that type of feature is going to seem like wasted money. If all you need your sunglasses to do is to make the world a little darker in your 15 to 25 minute commute back and forth to work every day, if you're not dependent on the clarity of your vision for life and death situations, then having lenses that are true to color, that are polarized, and that give you a very clear view of the world because they don't scratch and they don't smudge, that might not be worth the extra money that you're going to pay over a $30 pair of gas station sunglasses. For the rest of us, there's options. And if it sounds like you might be one of those people that can't get along with a $30 pair of gas station sunglasses anymore, and you're willing to take the plunge on spending a little more to get something a little bit more premium, these are an option for you. There is a link down in the description. However, using that link doesn't make me any extra money. Feel free to look at that link and shop around and see if you can find them cheaper somewhere else if you're interested. Until next week, this is Free Field Training. You guys be safe and take care of each other. That's been your Free Field Training for today. While you're here, uh, check out one of the other videos that we made or down here, subscribe so you can see more. Or you could check out Patreon where you can see how you can get your name put on the videos like all these fine folks over here. I'll see you guys next time.